What's up everybody, welcome to a new video and today we will take a quick look on Binance coin and I will tell you in this video if I think that there is uh, currently an amazing buying opportunity because the price will go up or on the other hand if I expect here a further dump. So if you are interested definitely watch this video to the end. But before that I would like to ask you if you like my analysis and you like my videos I will be really happy if you hit that like and subscribe button and also if you type two comments under the video because it will simply help the algorithm to reach out my channel to a new people so thank you guys for doing that and now enjoy the analysis but before that i would like to invite you to my discord trading group where i am sharing everyday crypto analysis on bitcoin and other altcoins that i'm currently watching so if you want to trade with me and be part of my trading community you can join this group and link to join is in the description or in the comments Today's analysis will be probably more in like a long term perspective because mainly I will be using the weekly chart because on the weekly chart we are currently testing the most important support area which is currently between levels 215 and 203 and you can see that historically for the past couple of years this was really really strong support you can see that we use this area as a support here then here and then here so if there will be a breakdown and then resistance confirmation confirmation so that means that the weekly candle will close under this uh, support area then i think that there can be a pretty pretty good opportunity to enter a short position because in that case the price will likely to go down so if you want to short this coin now i think it's definitely not a good idea because we are still like testing this important support and even if there will be a breakdown under this support wait for a resistance confirmation on the weekly chart because historically you can see that we broke this support area twice here and here and you can see that the price like Im immediately when went back up so you always need to wait in that case for a resistance confirmation but if this will happen then i think that you can like let's say enter your position on the level approximately let's say 201 and you need to put your stop loss above this support so let's say on the level 220 this will be probably a long term trade so yeah do not use like high leverage and your last take profit target can be probably somewhere around here because historically we don't have here that much liquidity you can see that we like have been only once and the price like here went really really crazy up so if there will be a breakdown and then resistance confirmation then i think that there can be a pretty good opportunity for a quick drop so opportunity to enter a short position but um, always remember definitely take some of the profits before we hit this strong high and then move your stop loss for example to entry or on break even so you won't turn your profitable position into a loss and uh, when the price will be dropping continue like moving your stop loss with that so you can maximize your profit and again you won't turn your profitable position into a loss let's now switch to a long scenario because in this case i think that the long scenario can bring us more profit because like this uh, support area of course it can be broken but even if there will be a resistance confirmation i think that the price will get back in some point i don't think that like the price will go reach let's say level 50 but according to technical analysis it's possible because as i said we don't have here that much liquidity but to enter a long position i want to see some increased bullish volume here so let's say something like that or that so if there will be again a support confirmation above this support and we have here like increased bullish volume then i think that there can be a pretty good opportunity to enter a long position because your max take profit target can be this previous highs so let's say a level around 661 which from this point if you look on that it's move around let's say 200 percent net profit and your stop loss can be under this week low so let's say you are risking 16 or 17 percent net loss and you can get 200 percent net profit which i think is absolutely amazing risk reward ratio 
Again, I need to repeat, this will be probably a long term trade and definitely do not use like higher leverage because the stop loss in the trade can be approximately 15 to 16 percent. So if you, for example, use 10x leverage on isolated, you will get liquidated before the stop loss. But uh, as I said, stop loss, I would put, let's say, under this strong low. So let's say under the level 184. And your last take profit target, you can, for example, put under this week low. So let's say level 667, 666. And in that case, again, take multiple take profit targets because you, for example, don't want to uh, like the price tested this, for example, previous highs and then something bad happened and the price went back down and you got nothing. So definitely once the price reach, for example, this first important resistance, take some of the profits, move your stop loss to entry. When we reach this, uh, this highs, Oh, again, take some of the profits and move your stop loss, for example, under the previous support. Let's say it takes then some of the profits here and of course, save, save some moon back to this previous week high. And in this case, there is risk reward ratio approximately 13. But if you take like the profits on the multiple take profit targets, the risk reward ratio will be, let's say, around 7, 8, which I think it's still absolutely amazing. I also want to show you some interesting setups from, let's say, for our chart, so from the short term perspective. But you can see that just nothing interesting is currently here. We are testing this important support and we are under this bearish order block. So let's say if there will be a breakout and then support confirmation, you can speculate on the bullish move to this next uh, resistance, which is between 248 and 244 but if we for example let's say enter the position here you need to set your stop loss under this previous low so it's like uh, risk reward ratio approximately 1.8 which i think it's still not that good so personally i won't be taking this trade so if you want to tra take some trades I recommend you to wait on a weekly chart for some support confirmation of this uh, of this support. Currently, we have here some really interesting bullish volume, so I think it uh, shouldn't take that long before we get some confirmation here. And if you want to copy my exact trades and you want to know where exactly I'm entering all of my trading position, you can join the Discord trading group and link to join is in the description or in the comments. Okay, thank you everybody for watching this video. I will be really happy if you enjoyed this this analysis, if you give me a like, subscribe, and also if you type two comments under the video, because it will help the algorithm to reach out my channel to a new people. Also, if you want to follow my analysis or copy my exact trades, join my Discord trading group and link to join is in the description or in the comments. But this will be all from me for today. If you have some favorite altcoin, you can type its name in the comments. And if like more people will be interested in this coin, I surely can make a video about it next time. But uh, again, this will be all from me for today. And yeah, I will see you tomorrow in the next one. See ya.